Are you ready to hire a contractor for your home improvement project? Here are some tips to save you unexpected time, stress, and expenses. First, make sure to hire a licensed contractor. Anyone performing home improvement work that costs $500 or more in combined labor and material must be licensed by CSLB. It's important to find out from your local building department if your project requires permits and confirm that your contractor will obtain them. If you don't already have a contractor in mind, you can go to cslb.ca.gov and select Find My Licensed Contractor to browse through a list of licensed contractors in your area. Not sure if a contractor is licensed? Here, you can not only verify that your contractor has a valid license, but also check on their bond and insurance information if any legal action has been taken against them, or if they have any disclosable consumer complaints. Double check that your contractor carries workers' compensation insurance to protect employees. And check if they carry general liability insurance to cover accidental damage. Note that general liability insurance is not legally required. You have five days to cancel a home improvement contract. Don't allow the contractor to begin work or pull permits during this time. And don't let anyone pressure you into waiving this five-day right to cancel. Also, make sure you get an immediate paper copy of the contract if you're asked to sign on a laptop, iPad, tablet, or other electronic device. Keep in mind that contractor-endorsed financing may have a higher interest rate and longer term than what's offered by a financial institution. Any home improvement salesperson that comes to your door must be registered with CSLB. Ask to see their registration card for verification. Always make sure to get three bids and check contractor references before making your decision. It's important to do your research and find someone who will get the job done right. In addition to these tips, look out for the following common contractor scams. Door-to-door -door solicitations. A solicitor may offer to do roofing, painting, or paving work with leftover material at a reduced or significantly discounted price. Once payment is made, little or no work is done and the project is abandoned. High pressure sales. A fast talking operator pushes you for an immediate decision about work, which makes it impossible for you to get the recommended three competitive bids, check the license, confirm permit requirements, and review references. Scare tactics. A person offers to perform a free inspection then claims a serious problem such as faulty wiring, bad plumbing, or a leaky roof will put you in danger. This can lead to unnecessary and overpriced work. Verbal agreements. The contractor states that a written contract is unnecessary and then does poor quality work or none at all. It is difficult to prove what was agreed to if it's not in writing. Demand for cash. The contractor insists that you pay in cash, sometimes going as far as to drive you to the bank to withdraw funds. With money in hand, they abandon a substandard or unfinished project. Illegally large down payments. A contractor takes more for a down payment than is legally allowed, claiming to need instant cash for supplies or to pay workers. In most cases, a down payment cannot exceed 10% of the total project price or $1,000, whichever is less. You can learn more at cslb.ca.gov seniors.